everyone and welcome this is jane from jliberated.com i am here once again to add value to your life by helping you overcome fear shame resentment and you will never get stuck again in life not seeing results change what you sow change the seed because whatever we sow is what we are going to reap when we sow a tomato seed we are not expected to reap a pepper seed or pepper fruits one thing that is setting in our life is we need to be content of who we are and who we are born to be don't be in a hurry to quit that thing you do that hobby that career that marriage that happiness in the bringing up of your children don't be quick to quit that thing you do just because you are not seeing results but be quick to change the seed you are planting so that you'll be able to see a more positive result in your life when a car or when you buy a new car if you don't fuel it it will not take you to anywhere the same thing in what you do with your business or the same thing you should do with your business with your life with your happiness with your health Try as much as possible to check the seed you are sowing. Learn to sow your seed in faith. Learn to sow your seed in happiness and in joy. Because life is too short to be wasted on negative things. If you know what you are saying right now with your life, maybe you have experienced disappointment in marriage in relationship maybe your business is not working maybe your job is not bringing you that fulfillment or happiness change it look for a better thing that will make you smile in the money look for a better job that will make you wake up in the money and you are so excited to go to that job change the seed you are sowing so that you will be able to see positive results with your life, if you know you don't like your size, your shape, or whatever, do things about it. I am not saying you should go for plastic surgery or whatever. I am telling you that when you don't see results or maybe you are eating an unhealthy uh, diet or unhealthy meal, you need to check what you are eating. Change the seed you are sowing in your head and you will begin to see positive results. Are you hanging around negative people, friends? Yes, sometimes we learn from them. But if you want to see results in your life, it's better you hang around positive people, people that can uh, help you grow, people that can hold you accountable for what you do. People that love you and respect you and accept who you are born to be. Do you, do you remember the story of Rahab in the Bible? Rahab was a prostitute. She must not be happy with her situation, but she chose it. And when the time comes for a change, she changed the situation immediately and begin to walk to see another result in her life. She changed the seed. And when the spies came to her house, she was quick to request what she wanted from them and thereby setting herself free from the wrong seed she has been sowing seed of prostitution what is it that has taken over your life today don't quit there is still time for you to make it just for you to realize that the seed you might be sowing will not give you the results you want in life if you are not seeing the results you want change what you are sowing because we are going to reap whatever we sow Sow your seed in faith, sow your seed in love, sow your seed in happiness, and above all, sow that seed in your uniqueness so that the world will hear you and experience what a great human being you are. I hope I have succeeded in adding just another value to your life today. Please, if you are new to my YouTube channel, do subscribe. Take time to check the links in the description box. It will take you to my website where I blog every single day. They are all motivational. And if you want to receive my motivational guide called Freedom Guide, it is all free. It will soon be online and you can download it. 
Have a fantastic day. But remember, I am your sister in Christ. Love you all. Bye for now.